Welcome back fellow coders, Jared O'Leary here with Boot Up. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to code buttons for a project. So you might be thinking, hmm, okay, we got Scratch Cat, we got a color button, all I have to do is just, first zoom in, make it so that when I click on this sprite, it changes the color effect, and I click on the button, and uh, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, so what happened is we added in this code and it's changing the color of this sprite rather than our scratch cat. So we need to actually get rid of this. Goodbye block. And we're going to use a message event. So under events, we're going to broadcast a message. So what's essentially gonna happen is when we click this button, we wanna send a message to the other sprite, our scratch cat, to say, hey, change your color. So to do that, we just send a message. And we're gonna call this color. Okay, so that's all we need for our color button, great. It's working, but it's not changing. The reason why is because now over in Scratch Cat, we have to say when I receive the message that is called color, then it's going to actually change the color. So when Scratch Cat receives color, now it'll change the color effect by 25. So I click and it's going to change Scratch Cat. Awesome. So if you're going to add in more buttons, you just add in more messages. So for example, there are other different kind of effects that you could add into here. So maybe you wanted to add one that is for whirl. So to do that, you'd have to say, when I receive whirl, then change it by whirl. And you'd have to make a whirl button. And when you click on that whirl button, it's going to broadcast the message called whirl rather than color. So for every single effect or thing that you want to change with a button, you're going to create a unique message that you're going to send. And it's kind of like sending a text message to a friend. So it's like, hey, a uh, friend of mine, whenever you receive this te text message that says uh, color, I want you to change your color because you know, my friends are chameleons. So have some fun with this. Uh, just uh, remember that the broadcast and when I receive message are inside the events section of your code blocks. Hey everyone, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not watching us on YouTube, you can find us on that platform as well as other social media outlets by searching for Boot Up PD. And if you're looking for more free lessons, projects, and resources for teachers and students, visit us at bootuppd.org, where you can also learn about our high-quality professional development.